All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game, One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Starfield Part 17. And I really legitimately think today's the day that we managed to pay off our mortgage, our, our 125k debt on our dream home. Which would be fantastic. Can't transfer anything there. Yeah, we're just going to be overweight. That's just how it's going to have to be. Let's go ahead and sit in the seat. And then we're going to have to keep scanning at a later date. But for now, to New Atlantis. <laughs> I've been, uh, we're going to be looking at this ship for so long. It's going to be so long before we get a better ship. Oh my god. But at least once we pay off this 125k, we can actually start saving up to actually buy something. To actually get a ship. So I'm looking forward to that massively. Frozen Mountains is still 75. Mountains is 85. Coniferous is still 80 because of the crocodons, I'm guessing. Where's the deciduous forest at? No? It's hard to find the deciduous forest, apparently. There it is, 80%. Okay, yeah. Um, Not any of those. Not the lodge. We want New Atlantis. And we'll go talk to Kelton Frush today. Why not? We, we put it off for a little bit, but let's go make some money and all that good stuff. All right, trade authority reset. It's not reset yet. Anything you need to offload? Trade that, authority is always by. That's important to know. So, yeah, we're gonna have a lot of weight we need to offload, and we need to do it as fast as possible, as conveniently as possible. Let's keep moving here. Yeah, I appreciate it. I am doing that. Thank you for the no bounty callouts. Let's see if Jemison Mer Mercantile has any more for us. I They should still have a little money on them, right? Maybe enough to get us not over-encumbered would be ideal. What do you have if for you us? See what you want, feel oh, please, take a look. Yeah, she still has all 5,000. Let's go. Okay. This is buy, not sell. All right, vendor sell. <clears throat> Here we go. Calibrated Grendels, we don't need those. Corned UC Naval Cutlass, that is cool. But pass. Uh, we need one Equinox, we don't need more. I'll hold on to that for now. The Ripshank Med Theft. Chance that humans drop extra med packs on death and plus 100% damage against robots. Pass. Calibrated Maelstroms, modified Equinox. Sorry. Hope you didn't hear that, that was gross. Uh, removed cover fully automatic. No, we don't want it. We don't want an automatic equinox. Hard pass. Damn, that gun could be really good. We'll see. Spacesuit, so we don't need Re deep recon. Spacesuit looks good. It's just not good. So sell that. Pack calibrated navigator backpack. Get that out of here. Apparel. We have all kinds of apparel apparently. Why am I in buy? Put me in sell, please. Why was I in buy? Scaring the hell out of me with that. Thank you. And thank you. We appreciate it. Keep selling. Keep selling. Do you sell Digipicks, though? Four Digipick. Purchased. Give me those. Back to selling. Okay, we're good there. Some of these do give bonuses, though. Um. Okay, and then go to ship inventory for the for the rest, other than whatever Sarah has on us. How do we not have extra resources, but we're still this encumbered? I can't believe it. Okay, hold up now. Are we gonna get... Oh, God, no. 
Thanks for shopping at Jemison Mercantile. Don't tell me we're not going to be at 125,000. Sarah. There you are. Been a long time since I've been glad to haul whatever you need. Yep, thank you. <laughs> I don't think you meant that. Okay, weapons. Give me these. Give me that. Oh yeah, she's got a lot of valuable stuff. Did you see one of those Grendels was doing 18? Did I see that right? No way I saw that right. Packs. She she's gonna need a she's gonna need a spacesuit, right? I might give one back to her because that seems weird that she wouldn't need one. Um. Thanks. Let me let me give you one of the spacesuits back because I think you might need, I think you might need that. I don't think that's optional. There's no way a spacesuit is optional for these people. Hold on to this one, I guess. It's not even worth much for how good it is. There, you have a spacesuit now. Until later. Alright. Oh, hello. If it belongs on your ship, oh please. I'm sure we it have it for sale. Uh she's not gonna be able to get all the stuff we want to sell, but that's alright. Corner drumbeat. I just I just don't know if I want to sell that. Sell the normal Kraken, though, for sure. The extra Equinoxes, for sure. The extra Lawgivers, for sure. And the Maelstroms. 211. This one. Here we go. Yep, sell that for the full value. And we're at 121.7. Okay, okay. Come on now. 3,300. We just need 3,300 credits from somebody. <clears throat> Surely we can get 3,300 credits from somebody. Thank you. Transit car to the commercial district. I think Outland bought everything, right? I think Mount. I think Outland buys everything. I think so. And if they don't, you see surplus. Not surplus. Um, USC, UC Delivery Center or whatever? Definitely buys everything, right? We just need 3,300, please! 3,300 credits. Surely we can make that happen. Help me out. I'm pleased to report that our stocks are currently being maintained at 90% or higher. I'm sure we have anything you might need. Welcome to UC Distribution. Something I can do for you? I'd like to see what you have for sale. Oh, well, certainly. She's got 56. Okay. As long as we got the stuff. As long as we got the stuff, she's got the money. Maelstrom? Yeah, look at this. Long barrel, short scope, semi-automatic Grendel. 18 damage. That is so much better than what we have for 777, I believe. Or are we saving that for something? We didn't have a good Grendel, actually. Modified calibrated maelstrom. Interesting. Tactical grip in a large magazine. <clears throat> this looks crazy good, by the way. 18 damage, semi automatic. 60 fire rate's not bad. It's better than the Equinox, and it does 18 instead of 13. Yeah, that Grendel's looking nice. With a short scope, too. Hold on to that. Hold on to that. Um, spacesuits. Here you are. We're gonna do it. We're definitely going to make it. 124.8. And... There it is. Boom. And bow. 125,000 credits. That was a grind. But we got there. <laughs> Boy. It's going to be nice to not have that on our... Like, hanging over our shoulders anymore. It's going to be beautiful. Um, sell from ship inventory. Um, looks like it's good. My mass is still almost capped out. What? Why? Maybe I do need to sell this. 
Let's let's sell that. Cutter, um, Equinox, Lawgiver. We have a bunch of weapons, to be fair. And a lot of these weapons take up a lot of weight, which makes sense. Ammo doesn't take any weight, which is good. Spacesuit, pack, helmet, apparel. Is it just all our resources? Really? Ah, uh, we also have a lot of aid. I'm sure we could sell a bunch of this aid, to be honest. Addic addiction symptoms? Whoa. Yes, gen alien genetic material. We were talking about possibly selling that. They're a pound each as well. And they're only 30 seconds of damage resistance? Using experimental crafting and research. Mm. Hard to get rid of something like that. Could hold on to the water. Heal paste, heart plus. Yeah, Hippolyta is going to be really good for persuasion, so we'll hold on to that stuff. A single malt whiskey, like a juke pack, like a juice pack. What? Why does it look like that? Sparkling wine, supernova. Whoa. Oh, minus O2 recovery though. Pass. More carry capacity is always nice. All right, that's uh, everything I can really get rid of, and our max, our mass is still pretty damn high. Hmm. Okay, I guess. Nothing else I can really do about it, is there? I guess we just have to roll with that. No forty-five caliber. Some ultra mags on the urban eagle. The fact that this urban eagle does thirty-nine and it can fire at the rate it does. Way better than the lawgiver, that's for damn sure. There's no way this is the best use of 50 caliber bullets, so I'm going to sell it. Alright, 120 mass. That's still a lot of mass, but... Back to it then. Let's go pay off the 125, and then we are going to be broke, but in the clear. And next time parents take 2% of our credits from us, they'll be like, what? Seems like the crimson I don't even know what this dream home looks like that I'm paying for, but we'll find out eventually. Hey, hey. Together we can really make a difference. Want to talk to you about my house on the soy? Certainly. So there are two ways to take care of a loan for good. Right. One's easy. Just pay off the balance. We've heard this. The, house is yours. the other option. Pay 125,000 credits. I'd just like to pay I'd like to just pay the loan off. Everything is in order. Excellent. Let me be the first to congratulate you on owning your house fully. No more mortgage payments for you. I have to Wonderful the paperwork, but I wish you all the best. Appreciate it. Boom! We building materials added to ship's cargo hold. What? My my car my ship can't handle that. It's actually a no go. Please don't. <laughs> Is that allowed to go over cargo weight? Because <laughs> otherwise it's not going to work out. Alright, let's go talk to Kelton Frush, I guess. What more do you got for me, Kelton? You keep calling me back. You just can't get enough of me, I know. I don't know, I know. I'm just, I'm just too in demand. Space pack boost. We meet again. Yet again. Why are you not talking to me? Oh, there you are. I was hoping we might run into one another again. Your timing is most fortuitous. I'm on the verge of something, but I don't quite have all the information I need. Of course you don't. You never seem to have all the information you need. If you're still paying, I'm still listening. Well, actually, Mast would be paying, but I see your point and assure you that you will be compensated for your time. Fair enough, then. Keep of going. Of course, now that I understand more about what's going on, it seems plain as day. And yet I never would have imagined it before. The tertiary trunks have also liquefied their interiors, but they're not vibrating. I thought perhaps it was some sort of defect, but it's much simpler. They're listening. How do you know that that's what's going on here? I don't. Not for sure. It's all a theory, certainly, but... It is completely supported by the data and observation, like all good science. 
It's the best we have to go on right now. I don't understand what that means. It means it is ready to reproduce. Oh. I believe this tree is sending vibrations out over massive distances and expecting to detect sympathetic vibrations in return. As of yet, there's been no response. I suspect that will not change, that a response is impossible, and that's very, very bad news. Why is that? To find bad news. We're continuing to see an increase in the strength and frequency of the vibrations. I don't know how much more significant it will become. If there's no response, the tree may vibrate itself and some nearby portion of the city to destruction. Maybe we can now, find another tree for yet, it? There has been no response. And clearly, none of the nearby individuals are a correct match. It's While too massive. It can't be ruled out that the intended recipient of these messages was cut down during the city's expansion, there is one other possibility. Over a hundred years ago, the United Colonies and the Free Star Collective emerged from the Narian War. Okay. As a gesture of peace and goodwill, a near literal olive branch, one of the trees from New Atlantis, was offered to the leaders of Aquila City. Oh my god. <laughs> that seems like a, okay. What a weird choice for a pute's offering. Sure, we'll say it's a nice gesture. Short sighted and ill advised, in my opinion. I tried. Of course, you can't just uproot a native species and plunk it down on some other planet in a totally different environment and expect it to grow. Clearly, no exobotanists were consulted ahead of time. The end result was wholly predictable. The tree died within a few short years. Oh, boy. I, uh, so that's a dead end, pardon the pun. Clever, but no, not necessarily. The tree died, yes, but branches were kept. At least one still exists in the museum there in the city. If I had that branch, I could get DNA samples and then using various data I've gathered, I could attempt to simulate a response. We could then broadcast that response and hopefully calm down our friend here. But as I say, I need that branch. That's quite a journey, my man. <laughs> I'll be back with it as soon as I can. <laughs> I knew you would understand. The museum in Aquila City is under the supervision of one Miss Kessler, I'm told. Okay. I don't know anything about her, but hopefully she'll be willing to listen to reason and assist our cause. All right. Doubt. We, we don't have any time to waste. Doubt. All right. Speak to Leah Kessler. That is... That is... Uh, yeah. Okay. So, doing full paid off. Done. Read the secret outpost slate. Oh, whoa, whoa, that's right. They did mention that, didn't they? I didn't even read it. Why didn't I do that? Secret outpost. Two of them. <coughs> Loyal to your crew. I get it, but screw that. Beg, borrow, steal, kill to get to Denabola 1B. There's a secret outpost we're trying to crack. Once in a lifetime opportunity. You'll regret it for the rest of your life. You don't get your ass over here. All right, Denabola 1B has apparently got a secret outpost of sorts. We need to go investigate. Mantis updated. Go to the secret outpost at Denimola 1B. We have... S uh oh. There's a time limit on this? Oh! Deliver laser diodes to Red Mile! I need to go to Red Mile anyway! Wait. That actually works out so perfectly. But we only have two days and 16 minutes. 16 hours left. Yeah, we gotta do that. Alright. That's not what I was gonna do next. But we, we actually do have to go do that. No wrong mission. <clears throat> Alright, let's go. Back to the ship. <laughs> We've got a time limit on this. I didn't know that. I'm glad they tell us there's a time limit, though, rather than surprising us with it. Could be worse. Bye, Sarah. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> See ya, sucker. Okay. All right, let's get on it, Ben. We got travel to do. I was, like I said, I was gonna do the Vanguard mission first, but looks like we're gonna busy be busy somewhere else first. Also, my poor ship's cargo capacities. 
are just not there. It's so tough. So tough. All right, talk to me. You should have. Hey, what can I do for you? I'd like to view and modify my ships. Let me see what ships you have for sale. I'm sure you can. Is it the same seven? Like it's got to be the same seven. Yeah. So I can come get the shield breaker whenever I'm ready. Look at the laser damage on this thing. Damn. It's a class B. Oh. Yeah, these are all class A's, but you need a piloting level three to be able to pilot a class B ship. But this shield breaker is a class B ship. Got it. So you need to have level three piloting to be able to pilot this ship in the first place. It is a massive boy, isn't it? That is, <laughs> that is a huge ship. That would be so fire to have that. Look at the difference between that and this. Oh my god. It's not... It's a, almost twice the size. Not quite, it doesn't look like, but almost twice the size. Wow, wow, wow. The Sparrow's tiny. It's got much better cargo capacity than mine, though. I can actually start looking at ships to buy. I'm so excited. Achilles. The Galileo. That's a good ship, but its cargo is nothing. 200 cargo capacity? Capacity is not going to do it. Whoa. It's got 1,100 fuel instead of 50? 1,100 might be the biggest here. Yeah, it's got twice what the Shield Breaker has. So the Galileo's like, I'm exploring. I'm out of here. Looks cool. One of my most important features, in my opinion, is this cockpit. What does it look like when you look out the cockpit, you know? That one looks fine. But that it could look better. I think we'll find a better ship than the Shield Breaker one day, but... We can always keep this in mind if we don't. Okay, no problem. Okay, modify sh the frontier. <laughs> Here it is. Isn't it beautiful? Go off. Okay. Six laser, 13 ballistic, 47 missile. Two crew, 310 shield. It can jump 18 light years with 50 fuel. It's way over cargo capacity. Which it wouldn't even let us do normally. So it's cool that it even let that happen. Um, Shipbuilder? Shipbuilders allow you, allows you to fully design, modify, and paint your ship. The floor gauge to the right tells you where new modules will appear when the floor gauge is at zero. For example, new modules will be placed in the center mass of the ship. Uh, building new ship modules will cost credits, and deleting them will give you credits back. The shipbuilder will keep a running total and process the entire transaction at the end. There's a flight check that will give you warnings or errors if your design is invalid for any reason. Okay. Would you look at all this? Landing gear, port aft. Need the landing gear. Yes, please. Um, what do we add? A shield generator. Structural. Weapon mount? Okay, wait. Damn, no. I was thinking maybe we could get inside here. Landing bay cargo. A cargo hold, which would add 210 more cargo to it for only 750 Really? Where would it go? Hmm. All in birth. Engineering bay. I was kind of looking for something to, um... Be able to craft inside, but I guess not. What is that engine right there? The Supernova 2000 engine. 19,000. You starship design level 1. Alright, forget it. We don't have any money anymore. Any, like right now anyway. We just spent all our money, so... 
All right, we've got only 2,000 credits to our name, but damn it, those 2,000 credits count for something. It's a pleasant change of scenery. Yep, let's make a delivery. Let's sleep once we're in space, so it's actually tracking our progress a little better. So we have slept six days out here, which means we should have 18 more than that, so 60 hours slept. So we're missing a day of sleep. And it's about to be a new day again. So let's go up in the air and sleep for 12 hours. What do you say? Take off. Maybe we should go to our destination first, then sleep 12 hours, but you get my point. Day 13 coming up, apparently. Alright, no crazy Haroon idiots trying to fight us in the middle of uh, this super packed space. Damn it, man. Where is Red Mile? That's where Red Mile is? A level 30 region? You're joking me. You're actually joking. That, that quest is getting failed. Um, that's not happening. If I'd have known, I wouldn't have taken it. Uh, uh-oh. Yeah, so... What happens when you fail a mission? Reject. She want to reject this mission, yep. Does that open my cargo up? Couldn't do it. Sorry, I, well, I was going to do it, and then it just became something I could not do. Yeah, there you go. All right, so our mass is back down. Put a bunch of resources in there. And I mean a bunch of resources in there. It's probably not even gonna be able to take them all. Yeah. Ship's all full again. So. Oops, that's not what I, that's not what I needed. Stop, stop, stop. Research station. <laughs> we could do the, um... Do I have any battle stims? Do I need to make battle stims? Okay, we could do beverage development. We could do manufacturing. Let me see what happens if we use that one thing that says we can use less resources for 10 minutes. The research station thing? Um, what is it called? Synapse Alpha. Research products require fewer resources for 10 minutes. Okay. Here we go. I'm big brain right now. Enhancement 2, we don't have infantry alpha, whatever that is. We don't have battle stims either. Old Earth Cuisine. We go beverage development 1. Put a water in there, and then boom. Beverage development 2 unlocked. We don't have aromatics or tranquility sunray. Okay. Okay. Uh, decoration, robots... First, let's do this stuff. We don't have cosmetic. How do we get cosmetic? There's some things I just don't understand how to get. That's my main problem. Like adhesive! <laughs> how am I supposed to get this stuff? You're killing me! No titanium, really? I feel like we had titanium. Guess not. There's gotta be a way. 
And I'm sure you guys are leaving a comment like six videos ago about how to get adhesive, but I'm playing this game so fast. I don't have time to get answers from it from anybody. Um, cause it's really stopping us. Okay. Um, we'll come back to this. And maybe we're just going to have... Maybe you have to buy certain things. Disappointing if so, but... You see Sec Longsword 2 Unintelligible Chatter. Okay. Uh, yeah. Maybe I have to buy adhesives. I'm not sure. I would hate that, but... <laughs> I mean, it, it could be reality. Might not be a matter of what you like. It could just be the way things are. Okay. We need to finish this up. Frozen Mountains land. Could land here. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's a whole moon there, isn't there? Coniferous forest. We're missing some stuff. Mountains, we're missing some stuff. Let's see what's here. We need, we need to get these fauna. We need to get this wrapped up. So we can leave in peace. That looks so good. With the birds flying off and all that. The Terra Hawks. The Parrot Hawks, whatever. Alright. We landed right next to some stuff. Okay, off we go again. Let's hit it. Should be plenty of organic materials to harvest from this world. You would think so. 300 meters that way. We're not missing that. I wonder what species we're missing. There's a fauna in this area that I don't know... Where we'll want to find it. But I guess we just explore for a while and... Eventually stumble across it. I'll let you all know if we get a development while I'm running over to... Nah, never mind. I'm not going to make a cut. It's right there. But yeah, uh... We might have to make some moves like that. Where, <laughs> where I cut out for a bit while searching. Where would these things be? I wonder. Damn, that parrot hawk looks big. And to be fair, at the locations is almost never where you find these things. I'm considered in combat right now. Nice. Get that challenge done easy. Oh, I see. Now there's a species. Is there a weapon we need to try out? This we might want to try out. Um, we kind of already have a bunch of stuff. We can put this on nine for when we feel like it, I guess. But for now, the equinox seems to be doing the job. The equinox is so inaccurate. There it is. We didn't sleep. Shit. What is wrong with me? Next time we go up, I, I gotta remember to do that. Deserted UC lit listening post. Thank you. I saw the experience come in and went, wait a minute. That's not how much experience I should be getting. Oh, we can go inside. More pirates, I'm sure. Time to get their stuff. They see us through the window. Okay, good. Nice, Sarah. Got one. If you're searching, then make it quick. 
I'm doing it. Oh, because we're in the middle of combat? That's fun that she says that, because a lot of people have a tendency to loot while there's still combat happening. Time to earn a living, she says. Bye, Pirate Brigand. Without your extra red health bars, you're doomed. There it is. Reload. Done. The combat is very satisfying. I enjoy it quite a bit. Where? There you are. Okay. So far, so good. So far, really good. Okay, this person might have a legendary on them because they have that special health bar. Now look at you. Okay. I knew it! Incendiary pack. Galvanize. 10% chance to ignite nearby attackers. Okay. Yeah, if they have those, like, red bars where they get their health back. Ooh, hell yo. Mind if I do? Um, yeah, if they have that, then they have, um... Legendary items on them. That's how it worked kind of in Fallout, so... Makes sense. Expert lock. We have Digipix now. There's stuff in there, for sure. Okay. We are trying to do one... Okay, good. That with this is solid. And then we need to do it again, apparently. Two of the same one. That's weird. Not that. That's not gonna fly. There we go. And then these two over here? Sometimes they're a lot easier. Sometimes they're really not. Ultra Megs, yes! And an advanced AA9! This is why we weren't using the Grendel, because this thing existed. Look at the value of that gun! Oh my goodness! What? Whoa, an advanced Solstice! What are these advanced weapons? I'm so glad we had Digipix. Are you kidding? A second? What is happening? The following items are property of the security team. No unauthorized use under any circumstance. All items must be checked out prior to use and returned by the end of the day. One Combatex Solstice, five UC Combat Knives, and two AA-99 Assault Rifles. Follow me except if anything goes missing. And more Ultra Mags. Oh my god. Where are the other knives? I said five. I'm not seeing five. Okay, so holding down E is how I'm supposed to move things, just the baseball wasn't moving. Can I find adhesives anywhere, please? Maybe you do have to buy certain things like cosmetics and adhesives. Because I don't I don't think they're lootable from playing 17 hours and not finding a single one. That sounds not lootable to me. I could be wrong, but I could also be right. Wait a minute, those those guns are insane. 44 damage on those? What the heck? Another pirate here. Hey, guy. What the heck is right? Or are you still doing a lot? Sidonia is an industry. Okay. You're in the way. I'm trying to loot lockers because I've found that these are actually pretty good sometimes. Not this time, but sometimes. A sparkling mine? What is a sparkling mine? Cred stick. I feel like I would have missed that back in the day, but now I'm getting a better feel for loot that I, that's worth picking up. Another safe, okay. More ultra mags. Love that. Good. I'm, I was about to say, where are the digipicks at? Because I'm spending a lot already. Okay. Alright. 
time to spend two more. Does blue mean it's the right pick? Is that what it's trying to tell me? What's happening here? Uh, that won't work. No, that won't work. Hmm, I wonder. Two and two we don't have, so that's not going to fly. That means this one doesn't actually fit like we think it would. No, there is no two and two. Okay, that does fit there, and then there's a 1-2 combo here. There we go. Finally. We found something. And then... There, and then a 3 combo at the bottom. Nice. There we go. 20 shotgun shells, 380 credits, med pack, and a suppressed... A suppressed coachman! We got our first shotgun for, you, for all these caithless shells we keep picking up. Oh my god, the weapons we're picking up in here are actually mental. This was so worth exploring, it's unreal. I mean, damn. Before we walked in this building, we didn't have we didn't have near this kind of firepower. This was the place to be, clearly. No regrets here. Okay, we've been here. Uh, Sarah. I wonder where this will all lead. If you gear. have any gear you want me to haul, I'm happy to help. Yeah, I definitely do. I, I've got massive problems carrying things right now. This, I can't believe. Look at the damage on these weapons. That's so wild. There's no way. There's no, there's no way. This is now useless, because this uses the same... No, it doesn't. The Grendel uses 777. This uses 11 millimeter. What was the 11 millimeter weapon we were looking at before? Huh, I don't remember. I actually don't. Hmm. I don't remember at all. We only have 27 rounds, which means we were using it with something. Because otherwise we'd have more ammo on it, right? Damn, I wonder what weapon we wasted it on. That's tough, actually. There you are. There you are. Alright, thank you. That, that gets a lot off my back. Appreciate it, Sarah. Bye for now. Imagine not bringing a companion with you to carry stuff. Could not be me. This is where we entered the whole building. Yep. And we went through there. Yep. And then we shot everybody down here and we looted them too. Okay, we are ready to go. We're all set. Let's head out. That was good loot. That was very good loot. Definitely worth the trip. More digi picks down, but definitely worth the trip. Now let's find this damn fauna. Oh my god! You okay, Sarah? You expecting me to jump down after you? No, I was trying to get trying. To, okay, don't worry about it. Just don't. Just don't even worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about it. All right. There's that. That's about the same distance, that's about the same distance. They're all about the same distance, that looks big. I guess, that's fine. I really just want the fauna though, so I can leave, to be honest. Big storage crate there. What do we got? Star Roamer pack. Sentimental wafer. Who? Oh, I'm good.
don't understand what fauna I'm looking for is the problem. I know there's a fauna I don't have, but what is it? What is it that I'm missing? And where should I be finding it? I just don't know. I just honestly have no idea. Nuclear fuel rod? Whoa, wait a minute. Exotic component. Yeah, it may not be worth it in cost, but I think that'll be good to have down the line. Like, is it the Beatles? Is it... What is it? What is it that I don't have? It's not the... It's not the Parrot Hawks, I'm almost positive. We definitely have that done, right? Yeah, it's definitely finished. I'm so lo... I got stuck in a divot. I'm so lost on what and where I'm supposed to find the things I don't have. Should I be looking for a cave? No, we have we have the we have the uh pack coral bugs. Those are done. I'm like we have the Kara snail scavengers. Coral bugs done. A ship here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Now, I'm curious. Let's see what's happening. We can go check out what that is while we look for whatever it is we're missing. But yeah, I have no idea. It's an absolute enigma for me. Ship landing site just appeared on the map. Genius. I don't know, is it something that's not above ground? And I got and I have to find a cave? It could be. Oh, they're Varun Zealots! Oh well then. They're they're leaving, aren't they? Man. Bummer. Well, we want the stuff, don't we? Nice accuracy. Down he goes. Come on. My character misses way too much. Okay. Thank you much, guys. We appreciate your donations. It's not going to help us find... The species we're missing. I don't even want to loot those locations right now. Like I, I really just want to get the the fauna I'm missing. It says it doesn't say biome complete, but I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, pack coral bug is done. Like we said, we'll take some water. Apparently, we don't have enough of that. Maybe that's a cave? I'm really just... Any resource we can use... To get what we're looking for. I don't think that can be a cave, though. We're getting so far from our ship. Alright, I will let you guys know if I find anything. See you soon, probably. Would you look at that? Sorry, there, there's there's probably not gonna be a cut there. This is a massive ship. Is it House Varun again or no? What am I looking for here? What am I looking at here? Hey, okay, go ahead and roar. Go ahead, go ahead. What am I looking at?
Med pack and Hippolyta, huh? Ecliptic Claymore. The Ecliptic, huh? I'm assuming Ecliptic are friendly. Okay. We got a little bit of stuff freaking out here. Is this a multi-story ship? What? This ship's big! That's a lot to navigate. Oh, my goodness. I'm an idiot. That's alright, you, you all can say it because it's true. This episode's gonna be a mess. Other than the fact that we paid off our debt, of course. Bro, this ship is huge. That does look better than what I have. I will admit. I want it. And it's take, not steal. Huh. So there's nobody here? It's just empty. Look at this! Yes! This is the kind of cockpit I want to see! Look how good that looks! Oh my god. Captain's locker? Cargo hold? Look at the high value minerals and the. Oh, take all. I can't just take this, can I? What is happening? There's no way this is just a ship I can have. What is happening? They have a prison down here? Dude, the ship is massive. I didn't even know the ships would get this big. There's a whole living space. Dude. I'm kind of at a loss. Something that would be adhesive. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm at a complete loss. What happens if I try to take off here? You just choose to open the doors, okay? Okay, it's not anything. Got it. You're not authorized to pilot the ship. That's what I figured. I was about to say, there's no way I can just go and sell this somewhere, right? There's no shot. Well, this was interesting. That was almost too good to be true for a second. It was still pretty cool, though. Alright, I'm going. I'm out. 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 Are you serious? Oh, Sarah, I'm sorry. Guys, that wasn't my intention. Okay. You're dead now. Automatic ecliptic spacesuit. Sure. Not their smartest move. Supply station. Location discovered. Is this going to be a friendly place? Where they can tell me where the damn... <laughs> other things are that I'm looking for and even if I find one of them is that going to be enough I have no idea oh, I'm over encumbered Sarah help a long time since I'd be happy to carry a few things for you thank you go ahead and take that for me 50% minus energy damage auto automatically use my kit when hit and health is below 25% once every minute that is pretty good it is pretty good, I won't lie. But the mass is real. Look at the protections! <clears throat> That's so much better. Yeah, never mind. Uh, take that off me. And I'll wear the ecliptic spacesuit. And by that I mean, let me <laughs> equip that. And then take that off me. There you go. Apparently I'm wearing that now.
Uh, weapons I don't need. Three Equinoxes, both Grendels. Calibrated Grendel. Okay. I can switch to this Solstice. For real, 237 rounds and it does that much damage? Talk to you later. Why am I using anything else right now? We moved on to new things so quickly right there. Uh, that instead of the Equinox, please. I'll use this Equinox... Oh, never mind. Here. Med kit. Alright, and I did the medicine challenge, apparently. That's probably a good one to level up, let's be real. <clears throat> Can't do that one for a bit longer. Destroy 15 ships, okay. Med packs, travel kits, and emergency kits restore 20% additional health, 20% faster. There you go. Medicine level 2. Ooh, we can start doing this tier now because we have enough points. There's three in here. True. Four, six, seven. We already could have done that, actually. Three more points to get to the bottom tier. That's kind of wild. Is this place broken down, though? Like, inaccessible, yeah. Cargo link's not active. Alright, I'm gonna go back to the ship. This is a dead zone. I'm really glad we came because we got some crazy good weapons. But... We're not finding the species we're looking for here. Oh, score. Yeah, we're just not finding what, we were, what we're looking for. So let's try somewhere else. <laughs> damage. Damn. Wow. Yep, that's how we're built now. That's how we work now. It's not you, is it? It's not you. Man. And the frontier is so far away now. I guess I'll see you guys after I get back. Here we are, we're back. Um, I still didn't find it, so yeah, we're gonna leave and go somewhere else. Bummer, bummer. All right, let's uh, this is already full, right? Yeah, it is. Oh boy, 
Yeah, we're gonna have difficulties for sure. Let's see if we can find the fauna next time. Hmm. Up we go. And I guess this is where we have to call the episode, unfortunately. Uh, I was really planning on finishing Jemison today, but the fauna just evaded us. But we did get some excellent gear, so I am pumped about that. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. But either way, thank you so much for joining myself and Sarah on this journey in Starfield. And we will see all of you for hopefully a little more success next time.